Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another episode of the Non-Cooperators. We are continuing with Metal Gear Solid Mobile. Hopefully, this could be, we're, we're close to the end. I mean, I've been here, yeah, like I said, about two hours playing this game. Not, I'm not saying I'm not enjoying it. I really am. I do like this. This is a really good expansion to like the Metal Gear franchise. Uh, for those of you that are like a really big Metal Gear fans, so I'm can definitely say I'm, I'm one of them. So here we go, infiltrating. I don't know if it's maybe two more episodes or the fuck knows. Oh wait, that's the, that's the bad guy. That well, you know the um yeah, that's him. You know who he reminds me of with that mask? He look, he reminds me of Null. And if you don't know who Null is, he is Frank Yeager back in Metal Gear Port Metal Gear Solid Portable Ops. If you guys, I mean, obviously, if you guys. Okay. <laughs> so that's whatever. Because I didn't even hear any gunshots, but whatever. Like I said, the game's very low. I feel like there's probably no sound at all whatsoever. So I apologize if there really is no sound. Like, completely, like, quiet at all. Like, fully quiet. I'm close, Otacon. I just saw him. In the flesh? In the flesh. You're definitely on the right track, Snake. The Metal Gear hangar is just a few more rooms away. Judging from the radio chatter I'm picking up, it doesn't lo uh, look like you've got very long until they, uh, they leave you. Okay, so, uh, okay, we, we, we entered through that door, um, killed everyone over there. I'm actually get second guessing, guys, because I think there probably is no sound whatsoever, because I'm looking at my, uh, my capture, and it's showing only that there's no sound. At least I don't think there is any sound. I don't know, I could be wrong, I really hope there's sound, but it could be very low. If it's very low, that's one thing, but if there's, like, no sound at all whatsoever, then I'm like, fuck! I just played for two hours with no sound. Except with me, just 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 chattering, ch chattering in your ear in the most annoying way possible. And I do apologize if there's no sound. I know I'm apologizing now after I just found out how many episodes in we're we're in. Eight, I guess. I don't know. I'm just I'm I'm, I'm I don't want to run into some 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 I don't want to run into some semtex. Where the fuck are we going? Wait, can we climb that? Okay, we can climb. Okay. I was gonna be like, I didn't realize that we actually have the climbing cape. <gasps> C4. An opportunity to use C4. Wait, uh, that's not how you use C4. Um. What is this? Okay, that works. <laughs> Wait, how does this open up? It doesn't just go... That's a lot of C4. Oh, I gotta shut down the steam, right? Do I need... I gotta shut down the steam, right? Right? Oh, no, I don't. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? You see that, right? Otacon. The everything around me just changed into something sort of... 3D image, like being in a computer game. Mission parameters have been exceeded, simulator and entering untested areas. What? Huh? I didn't say anything. Yes, you did. Something about entering untested areas. You must be mistaken, Snake. Otacon, what's wrong with your face? It's not very nice to say that, Snake. I happen to think I look fine. The signal must be slightly corrupted. I'll look into it. He's lying to you, Snake. Snake. Don't you think it's time for a break? Turn off the phone, Snake. It's the fog clearing, Snake. Your friend is not who he seems. Oh, cancel. So, we're definitely in a simulator. Yeah, we're, we are absolutely 100% guaranteed in a simula simulator. Shit, I have no idea where the hell I'm going. I don't, I don't know if I'm going the right way, guys. Turn the phone off. Yes, I'm, I'm playing a phone. Well, actually, to you, this is a camera. Now it's a phone. Basement 2 engineering. Are we anywhere close to where we're supposed to be? I have no fucking clue. Well, actually, that's the door he uh, shut up. Shut up the door and you're to blame. 
you give love a bad name I play my part and you play your game You give love a bad name You give love a bad name So I really do think that you're playing as Raiden in a, vi in a VR simulator Because I do remember Raiden, he did a lot of VR simulations And he even did VR simulations from the Shadow Moses incident if you read the comics, which I did, of course. Like I said, big Metal Gear fan. <laughs> Hello, I'm Stewie. Big fan. Oh, bullshit. Well, this is a, this is an automatic fight. Why? What do you want? Snake, you're sealed in. The only way out is to eliminate the two terrorists. You don't necessarily have to kill them, though. I wish you two would make up your mind. Huh? Mind. I want to use the fucking Famas, so fuck you of whoever says you don't have to kill them. I want to. Like, that's like I want to, it's just I want to just use this gun. Is that it? Maybe it's like two, two, two endings to that, I don't know. Everything's still in like an alert mode. The music. If you guys can hear it, by the way. Like I can hear, I can hear sound, which technically you guys should also hear it as well. But I don't know. It's it's not showing up on the um, on the scale where like the music is going like that, the sound is going like that. So if not, then I apologize, and I don't know what to do. It's time you learn the truth. Who are you? Why are you helping me? You were captured, drugged, and placed into the simulator to motion. I've been trying to access the simulator remotely ever since I managed to locate you, but who are you? I don't understand. I've been talking to you for... That isn't me, Snake. It's a fake. It's a fake. Ask him what I did the first time I met you. Otacon. What did you do the first time I met you back in Shadow Moses Island? Pardon? You remember, don't you? When you were hiding in that locker. I, uh, I peed my pants, Snake. That's right, I did. Glad you kicked that habit. It started to come back to me now. That's because you've been in the simulator long enough for the drugs to start wearing off. So, none of this is real. Real enough, Snake. You die in here and your heart stops, for real. So it's like the Matrix, basically! Who did this to me? I don't know. It took a lot. It, it took all my techno- uh, uh, my tech- uh, technical know-how just to hack the system. It's the most advanced AI technology I've ever seen. Whoever it is, I'm guessing they've got near unlimited resources. Patriots. So, what do we do? You've got to carry out, beat the, sim uh, the simulation snake. I'll carry on from here. Try to break out, uh, try to break out of here. And how do you know it's really, it's, how do I know it's really you? You don't. But I've disconnected the other, uh, the other meta, uh, from the codec. I'll keep you up to date with my progress. So, we are in a VR simula- Oh, we're in Metal Gear Hangar. Hello. So this is the end, I think. Maybe, uh, two more episodes, but I'll see what I can do about this one episode. If it's gonna- it might end like a half an hour or something like that, we'll see. So, let's do this! So he's gonna go Vulcan Raven on me with the fucking uh, minigun. Alright, so let me see what I can... Keep that... Oh, no, wait, 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 wait. Keep that, like, on standby with, with this. What are they giving me? M9 ammo, SOCOM ammo, and... Chaps. What's the chap gonna do, though? It seems like an easy boss fight. Fairly simple. Oh, so it overheats on him, and then that's my, my opportunity to like, attack. Why? 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 What do you want? Snake, we've had a breakthrough. Uh, we've had a breakthrough. I'm a little busy right now at the moment. This is important. Snake, I've got to manage to access. I've managed to access one of the simulator main control systems. 
So, you can shut it down? Almost. I uploaded a virus that should corrupt it enough to force a reboot. It should? Well, I didn't ex uh, exactly have time to test it, but in theory, it should work perfectly. One last thing, Snake. Shoot. The commander is especially vulnerable to Nokita missiles when his gun is jammed. Good, uh, find a good uh, vantage point from which you uh, fire. Someplace high. That gun takes quite a while, uh, while to jam. Any way you can speed things up? I can't. But dropping a chaff grenade should uh, disperse the electronic uh, components and cause it to freeze up and a little faster. I'll keep that in mind. Keep fighting, Snake. You're nearly there. Honestly, I'm just gonna go the old-fashioned way. Just keep tapping, just keep A-tapping, basically. At the head, at the head, at the head. Bang, bang, bang. Wait, no, I can't do it while he's on handicap mode, which is kind of idiotic, if you ask me. Oh, damn, now there's more peeps. It definitely seems very cold down here due to the fact that everyone's uh, breath is, you know. Ah, damn it, shoot the goddamn fucking thing. There we go. Equipment. Use that. Open. Can I reach him? Yes, I can. Think. Let me see if I can find a high band. Oh, see, everything's starting to get all fucked up now. Let me see if I can do this, though. Now nah, he'll stand up. Damn it. Hi there. How you doing? Whee! Alright, that's instant death right there for anybody. A friggin' Nikita missile to the face? I was gonna be like, I, I was in the middle of a Nikita missile. Is, is it gonna go... Is it gonna hit him? Come on. Oh, he's destroying the box now. Oh, they're explosives? Would that kill me? Like, instantly, or...? Shit. Everything's starting to break down, though, so that's good. Uh... But shit, I don't want to press that. Leave me alone! I need this one. I do like that they have the old classic uh, music in this game. It looks like everything uh, everything starts respawning. Maybe not everything. I'll just take him out with the bombs. Shit. Get him killed. Nope, 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 nope. Use. Oh, he's bleeding, so he's almost down. Hopefully I don't have to fight. I don't have to actually have to fight Metal Gear. Almost dead. I think. Is that it? Did we get him? Blah, blah, blah. Skadoosh. Dun, dun. Ba dum, bam, bam. Alrighty then. So let's see what happens. Simulation ended. I'm not gonna touch anything. Error. So I think everything just got fucked up. Here, I'll move this closer to me so you guys can hear me. Mission parameters exceeded. Ooh, whoops. Resetting, resetting, resetting. Oh, it's bright. Oh, so we got the lights in front of our face like in every Metal, well, Metal Gear 1 and 2. Voice 1. The simulation has been corrupted. All the data has been erased. The subject was more resourceful than, it, uh, than expected. Wipe his memory of these events, then release him. Alright, so we're probably not, we were probably, uh, he'll be, 
of use to us later. So he probably is not Otacon. That was probably, it probably might have been Raiden, but we, we actually will not know. Another subject must be, other subjects must be found. We've already selected a new candidate. Is it Raiden? Someone with more impressionable mind. Ex excellent. This is only a minor setback. Did I... Wait, is that it? Metal Gear Solid Mobile, press any key to resume. Oh, wait. Snake failed to give us the information we require. It just went to, it went to snooze mode. That, the, the phone, I don't know why. So is that it? Let us see if Jack can do any better. There you go. That's, that's Raiden. So we're playing as a random soldier in a simulator. So, this is the end... Oh, had... Hideo Kojima was the supervisor, it had nothing to do with the actual story itself, but still- Oh, wait, these are the voice. oh, wait, no. I was gonna say, those are the voices? No, there was no voices. I was the only goddamn voice. Italian text, Spanish text, German text. Special thanks to... Two people. Developer was Ideaworks 3D, production by San Wu Pu. Development, uh, produced by Carlo Brush, associate producer, Nemico Nebina, client, designer, designer, John Duffield. Designer management, Stanley Hood, Ian Pan, Richard Kelp, Colin, Colin, I don't know, every single time I hear Russell Clark, I, every single time I hear a Colin, I'm thinking, Colin Farrell! My wife says you're not a very good actor, and I agree with her. Now, now, why Colin? Why, why Colin? Why would she say that? So again, I don't know if you guys can actually even hear any music. I really hope you guys. I really hope you can. I'm gonna like. If I, I'm gonna. I didn't check any of the footage, which is really bad. And I really should have. No! Stop going to sleep. I know, I gotta keep playing with it so it doesn't go to sleep. So now we're just going through the credits, I just want you guys to see, like, every little aspect of it. Because I'm pretty sure there's probably gonna be some after credits scene, and, uh, seeing what happens in the after credits. So, those voices were obviously the Patriots, or people that were actually in control of the Patriots, or just an AI voice of the Patriots. We don't know. We're playing as a random soldier that was playing as Solid, S that was playing as Solid Snake. And... Uh... They were checking out if at the end they were gonna find out what let's see what Jack will do. And obviously Jack is Raiden. So this was actually a really good expansion story. So I, when I first started playing it, I thought this was an actual story of Solid Snake. It really wasn't. It's all about what Snake could have done or whatever or whatever happened. But honestly, this was cool. I definitely enjoyed this. This was really fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let's see if there's an after credit scene. I might have to fast forward this. Oh, okay, never mind. So, my ranking is a pigeon. I cleared it in an hour and 15 minutes. I eliminated 15 enemies, got 5 alerts, 5 rations, uh, radar was on. I didn't know how to turn it off or not. 2 continues. And that's it. Unless I gotta, do I have to do it this, hang on. Show it like this. Oh boy. Hang on, I'm fucking you all up. Okay. Ah, whatever. Do you want to update to the arena? Nope. Your score will be updated next time you connect to the arena. So. This has been Metal Gear Solid Mobile. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys. And if you guys have any suggestions on any other Metal Gear games I should play, I will absolutely play because I'm a big-ass Metal Gear fan. And we'll see you guys next time on the Non-Cooperators.